had a question regarding, uh, we had a discussion yesterday about it. When is the um, uh, a time where it's permissible to do wudu on the socks, not allowed to do on the socks, etc.? If you can talk about it, inshallah. Well, that same ruling that, are you, are you talking about in comparison with the leather uh, socks? Is that what you're saying? Or are we talking about the leather socks or the socks? It doesn't matter. No, the, the normal socks, you know, being at home with the family. Uh, are you trying to prove that you could do it in a leather so in, a, in a cloth sock like a leather sock? Is that the issue or the issue? What? No, I was. The issue is basically we're gathered together, um, but being at home together. Uh, it's, I was arguing that, you know, being at home, uh, take off the socks, do will do without the socks, and then put them back on. Um, the discussion was, I can have, have, I can keep my socks on. If you have worn these socks after you have made wudu in the morning or at any time, and you are within, you're a resident, and within the 24 hours mark, you may wipe on these socks. You don't have to take them off if you broke your wudu. If you are a traveler, okay. you have three days. From the third time that you wipe, like let's say you wore the socks, after wudu, after you prayed Fajr, when you made wudu for Fajr, and then you broke your wudu halfway Dhuhr, between Fajr and Dhuhr, then you have to pray Dhuhr, then you wipe on the socks, so the 24 hours or the 3 days, the 72 hours kick off from the first wipe, you may wipe on these socks for one day if you are a resident, 3 days if you are a traveler, regardless whether you're at home, whether you're Traveling or whether uh, or whether you're outside of home. Jazakallah khairan Habib. Mm -hmm.